Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a whole house clean with me. I will be tackling every room from top to bottom and will show you my tips and tricks along the way. So please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already and I hope you enjoyed this video. I find it best to start a load of laundry before beginning anything else. This is because the wash can be running while you're doing another task. So it's certainly the most efficient use of your time to get this out of the way first. I also like to set my Roomba to run on the floor that I am not currently working on. This allows me to clean the carpets upstairs while I am tackling the main floor. Typically I like to run it while I am out of the house because it is very loud. However, when I am doing a full house clean like this or if I'm home all day, I'll just run it on the floor that I am not currently on. I also prefer to empty the dishwasher at night if possible instead of during the morning hours just because mornings are hectic with the boys and it's so much easier just to throw the breakfast dishes in and not have to worry about emptying it first. But you show me life is full of faces 
Sometimes clouds got in our favorite places But we were young and unaware This shag carpet in the living room here is the only carpet in the house that the Roomba will not go over. Um, it gets stuck just because it is an extra thick shag, but it's small enough that I can just run over it with the hand vacuum and it's not a problem at all. But I'm now going to start the Roomba downstairs as I head on upstairs to tackle the second floor.
So as you can see from the title of this video and also the footage that you've seen thus far, this is definitely a deeper clean and not necessarily a daily or even a weekly cleaning routine. As I mentioned previously, we used to have house cleaners that would come in every other week to do a lot of the deeper clean items, such as the walls and the baseboards and the floors and bathrooms, um, which really helped. Um, and I was only then responsible for the day-to-day -day maintenance in between. But I, we weren't overly happy with the service and we figured letting them go would also help us save some money this summer. So I'm going to be doing these items moving forward. Um, the bathrooms are probably going to be something that I'll strive to do weekly, but if not every other week, whereas the maintenance of the kitchen and the toy cleanup was something that will happen daily as needed and some of the deeper items like the walls and the fans and the other dusting will probably happen monthly. Thank you so much for watching this video today. I hope it inspired you to take on a deep clean in your house as well. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and give me the thumbs up on this video and I will see you all soon.